Well, today I picked up the uh, original gas tank from the radiator shop. Um, and basically, these guys uh, coated the inside. Um, it's like a red epoxy. Um, so they, they boil it and clean it to make sure it's all, you know, no particles or rust or anything in it. And then they coat it with a, an epoxy um, coating. And you can see they tap, they tap a little plug right here. So once they coat it, they can drain it out. Um, and then they just paint it black. Um, you can see it's still got some of the original undercoating and whatnot on it. Um, but that really doesn't matter. What matters is the condition of the tank. Um, I got a new vented cap. Um, it's a GM still makes these. It's a, or I guess it's a, somebody had a NOS cap on eBay. So I went ahead and bought that. Um, and I might be able to show you, you might be able to see the red. Yeah. See, here's where some of the red epoxy where they poured it in, but the whole tank is uh, coated with that. Um, and it's resistant to uh, the ethanol gasoline as long as you don't put in more than a 20% mixture of uh, ethanol. Um, not sure about alcohol, but not running alcohol in the car. And you can see the original sending unit is still in there, so that's definitely got to go. So I picked up this new sending unit from Rob MC out in Nevada. He makes outstanding um, sending units, fuel pumps, uh, fuel filters, all aluminum, really, really nice stuff. Um, and you can see I got it fitted with, uh, it's got a cap on it right now, but those are AN fittings, um, a send and return. And you can actually cap the, uh, cap the return line if you don't use it. And it hooks up. See, there's the uh, ground, and then this wire hooks up to your, it reads the resistance up on your gauge. Um, so this old one's going to come out. What I also did, and what GM did, they, uh, I've got some of the 3M spray adhesive, and I glued on. It's almost like a rubber strap, which goes against the bottom of the vehicle. I glued those on. Uh, that's... That's how it was when it came out of the car originally, so I'll put it back. And then they put a pad in the middle. You can see where the glue is under there. Um, I put a little too much and it squirted out the side. But, and this is a, a foam pad um, that goes in the middle to uh, keep vibration down. Keeps the gas tank from vibrating against the bottom of the vehicle. Um, so anyway, gas tank is good for another uh, 40 years now. Um, no reason to buy one of those new gas tanks they're selling uh, online. Uh, you can't beat the original GM stuff. Um, it's very high quality. And uh, I don't know about those new, the new, you know, supposedly OEM gas tanks, but uh, I like to stick with the old GM stuff and just restore it any chance I get. So, anyway, thanks for watching.